anything, okay? All right. You're, you're okay like that, right? You're so somewhat comfortable. Okay, good. I feel a little bump under there, so let's see if we can't squeeze much out of here. I think we can. I think you might just have like a little more like a cyst. Do you have one of these instruments? Nope. Oh, you need a comedone just do extract. My fingers. Your fingers, okay. Those are good enough. This is gonna be one of those that kind of keeps on going a little bit. Sometimes people ask me why a cyst contents might be a little darker in color. And I'm gonna answer that right now. The reason is because skin color is different, right? The darker your skin color is, the darker your cyst contents will be because it's just skin that flakes into there. Okay, well, here's one for you. Okay. Um, so a cap forms over it. A cap. Yeah. You mean like a like a black plug, like a yeah, like a plug, like a um the so, black part. You mean the black crusty, like it's dark yeah. and okay. So how does it continue to fill up? Um, because it's like a sac under your skin, mm -hmm. and the sac it's it's almost as if your skin turned under it to itself, and you have a, like a little balloon of skin underneath there. So the skin keep, can you turn, continues to slough, you know, your skin will just slough or peel and it's sloughing off into the sac now. Mm. So that's why it's filling up and, and that's why it can get bigger under there. Even though you feel like, how can it, it's not like it's getting plugged. It's not outside material. It's not like dirt that's getting stuck in there. It's your own skin. No. All right, let's see if I can get all of this. We'll see, this one's a little bit under there. Are you getting stuff out? I got a good amount of stuff out, but mm -hmm. I don't know if I can get the whole thing out. I don't know if this one is gonna be, it might be something that recurs, but hopefully we'll get it all. Cause it's, you know, you have thick skin back here. I think I do see it, that is pinkness there. Like I've got the whole sack and, and at least on that side. You're okay though, right? That's the most important. Yeah. Okay. I, can I took a couple of John Wayne pills this morning. Oh, really? What John Wayne pill? Yeah. That's what it's called? Mm -hmm. Why what what did John Wayne why did John Wayne what kind of pills did John Wayne take? Macho. Yeah. Macho yeah. pills. Oh, okay. He's tough. He's macho. Okay, yeah, I love that. Yeah. I've never heard that. I'm gonna have to tell some of my pansy patients to take a John Wayne pill. There you go. <laughs> I think that's a little piece of this. Well, John Wayne right was a tough guy, you know, from the 30s, and 40s, 50s. Getting a little bit of the sack wall, and if I pull that, I think I can get the whole thing out, and we won't have to worry about it coming back. Just as long as I, I know he took his, he doesn't have to take John Wayne pills. I'm sure he's naturally like that. Mm -hmm. But, you know, this thing won't grab though. I want this forcep grab. You see that little edge there? That's just still a little of the sack wall. Yes. You can see it, huh? She's learning too. See, she knows how to do all this herself. She mm. might open a shop up, I think. So on this upper edge, we still have a little bit of the sack there. I can see it. You okay? I can put more numbing, by the way, if I'm pushing real hard on you. No, I'm okay. Okay. You guys were meant to be with each other. He likes his pop pimples popped, huh? And you don't mind popping them? Don't mind. But nobody else's. No, but what? Nobody I else's but his. Oh. I can't do somebody else's. You know, I can do my own, but I don't want to do anyone else's either. My husband's a dermatologist. I'm going to do this one here. A little pinch there. He's a dermatologist. And if he has a big pimple, I'm like, you better get take care of that. <laughs> I don't want to take care of it. He's got to take care of it. Though we do inject each other if we have a pimple. If you have like an active pimple, you can actually inject it with a little a little steroid and we'll make it go down in a day or so. Wow. Sorry. You know, these are really small ones. I think they're all, they've been, they've been dealt with somewhat recently, so. They're not, they're just starting to kind of fill in again. See this one over here, little one over here. Put a little nick in the skin and... Kind of if possible, I'd like to see what came out of that. Sure, I, I will definitely, I'll show you the video. Oh, okay. Oh. Ooh, there's a good one. I'll show you this one though. Look at that one right there. Pretty long one. Wow. 
Yeah. I'll give you a moment alone with these, okay? Like, <laughs> I'm just kidding. Well, so, so I can say goodbye. goodbye. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> give yours goodbyes. Been with you for a while, man. Uh, that one, one has, has certainly. Is, is there one that like, big um, one that you just did? Are you gonna stitch it or no? Uh, I don't think it needs a stitch. I think it's better if it heals, um, because it's not very deep. It's better if it heals because it's really on the edge, the side. I don't think if I seal it, I feel like if there's a little bit of a little cyst wall there, it's gonna come back. It's not gonna stay like a big hole or anything. But you know, it is a dilated. You know, I, I guess that's like on the edge. Here's one right here, way over here. What I do? You guys come from far? I would say, let's see how that heals. If you find that that's bugging you, if it's, it is a dilated pore, if, it, if it's what it heals, it doesn't look to your liking, I can definitely do that. It just requires like a little stitch and things like that, but I really don't think it's gonna need that. It's pretty small, let's take a look here. In fact, that's actually nice for our viewers, for people to see how it heals after a while. Did you see that one that was like a plug in a kitchen sink on that woman's back? That we called it like a coin purse? No. Oh, you have to see all the videos. There's so many more you haven't seen. That one's a gem. I watched a lot of them. Yeah? There's two way over here. Can you actually scan mm -hmm. all of them? Yeah. yeah, actually that's good, like that. that that's good. Oh, don't fall off the edge, though. No, no. Okay. I don't bounce, no. Okay. <laughs> Back in the day, I could fall and bounce and no problem. <laughs> But the older you get, the less bounce you have. Yeah, I agree. Just kind of go with a thud, huh? Uh-huh. the ground. <laughs> I envy babies. No. Yeah. Yeah. They oh, fall. God, they can hit hard and they just bounce right back. Yeah.